Local 24 News is your local election headquarters, but the University of Memphis is making it clear today it's not the headquarters for any candidate, despite a video from Senate candidate Marsha Blackburn that the university asked to be removed. Local 24's Rudy Williams is live in the studio to explain the controversy behind all this. Rudy? Good evening, Richard. It's illegal for state-supported schools to endorse any political candidate, but this video posted Friday on Marsha Blackburn's Facebook page gives the impression U of M cheerleaders support her. Here's a look at the video. Marsha, Marsha, Marsha! That's it. We contacted the Blackburn campaign to find out how this happened in the first place. Nobody from the Blackburn campaign has responded, but U of M students aren't cheering the play by the U.S. Senate candidate. One student wrote a letter to university leadership citing a federal election law violation. She goes on to say Representative Blackburn has grossly manipulated the university and its students for her personal gain. This offense does not solely affect the student body, but it also has an impact on the larger Memphis community. Now, for their part, U of M issued this statement in part saying U of M spirit squads do not endorse any candidates for political office in accordance with U of M policies. Political organizers were contacted to remove any and all posts suggesting endorsement by the University of Memphis. Well, Blackburn has since removed the video from her Facebook page, but critics say since she started in politics back in 1989, she should have known better than to involve students who did not. I'm live in the studio tonight, Rudy Williams, Local 24 News.